Welcome back to the Midwest Sports Show. Mm. Um, Sunday night. Yeah, Sunday night edition. Awesome. And uh, my name is uh, Chris Stotts, and then uh, that's uh, Gene Steichen. Hello. Gene, yeah. happy new year to you. Thank you. You're, 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 yeah, yeah. Uh, next week's a big week for the Packers, their cousin Dayton. For all of us. Uh, I was, in, you actually went, you went to the Midwest. I went to Texas. What did you say? What was your question? I said, happy new year oh, to you. Oh, that. Okay, good, good enough. All right, same deal. But anyway, we went to Texas and my family flew out to California and we all went to San Diego for the Holiday Bowl. If you don't say bowl games aren't important, you should have saw Iowa in the Holiday Bowl when we just took apart USC. Worst bowl loss since 1948. How's that? And then I did not make it to the Rose Bowl. How was uh, San Diego? It was beautiful. That stadium so crappy. Have you ever been to? Uh, the <laughs> no, I've not been. To, I mean, uh, look at the gas Qualcomm. lamp district is is spectacular. That's where the uh, Padres that's where the, play. Yeah, that's where the baseball stadium. Yeah, yeah. So they got the they got the Chargers, uh, like seven miles out in this, uh, surrounded by nothing, out in the middle of well, nowhere. Well, uh, it's surrounded by freeways. That's what yeah, it's surrounded freeways, by. Yeah, freeways exactly, it's, and, it, it, I, and it looks it, like an it, old concrete bunker. It's like an interchange. Yeah, it's like it's, the Qual- it Qualcomm be, interchange. It, for San Diego being so uh, beautiful, this could not be less more. I've been there before, but wow, that, that's whatever. why that, you know that's why when people tell me that uh, San Diego is better than L.A., no, it's not. Yeah, it's just mountains. It's just uh, you're you're driving everywhere. I mean, at least in L.A., you can uh, you know right you know walk but places. It, they should have built the Chargers a stadium downtown. But the main point is Iowa. Wow, it was so sweet. We, the way we can, I mean, we beat uh, USC forty nine to twenty four. It was so great. Glorious. And then I wanted Wisconsin to win the Rose Bowl, obviously, but boo-hoo. All right, well, Gene, we have a whole college oh, football see. segment. The big, the big Ten actually ended up going 4-5 and five in the bowl game. Minnesota, good job. Gophers beat Auburn. That was a big one. How about, but you actually made it to the Midwest, right? Yes. Yeah, so I – uh, I I uh, turned it right back care. to you. There you okay. go. Nice setup. Yeah, nice setup. Yeah, yeah, I did uh, go to uh, Wisconsin on Christmas Eve, landed around 5 a.m. So your flight was good. Everything was good there, right? Uh, yeah, kind of a hard landing. Uh, oh. There's a lot of wind, I guess. I think and I just uh, read today there's a plane that fell off the runway today in Wisconsin. I don't know what airport oh, yeah. is that. Oh. Well, it uh, seems like a lot of the flights uh, I've taken lately ha- have these hard landings. I don't know if it's just the quality of the pilots yeah, um, or if it's just the wind. Maybe there's more wind this year. I don't know. Maybe it's just you only remember the bad landings, not the good ones. Uh, but, yeah, Gene, uh, spent a uh, week with the family. Oh, see, now that's important. I did, too. It just happened we were in Texas, and then we're in San Diego, and then we drove yep. back to L.A. Yeah. Yep. And, uh, you know, by the end, uh, you know, I mean, it's a little bit different for you. I'm sure, you know, I'm sure if you went back to Iowa and stayed at your mom's place for like a week, mm. you know, you, you start tearing your eyeballs out. I know. Well, my family, they got in San Diego. My sister got an Airbnb for everybody. And I, I stayed in a hotel because I'm like, uh, no, thanks. I'm too old to be, you know. Yeah. So that that helped. I mean, not that I don't love my family very much. But it, it well, was th- th- there's a reason why we move out, right? There's a reason why you I leave. I think so. I mean, yeah. you can't, can't, can't stick around. Need a little privacy. Come on. <laughs> yeah. Or I would just something else to do other than uh, right, talk right. to the same people over and over again. But, Gene, we have a lot of sports to talk okay. about. So, oh, that was uh, great. So any, like, any, any, go- well, any good Christmas, Gene? Yeah, it was great. We uh, Any good presents? What do you guys uh, do for presents? Oh, my sister just goes all out. She really does. I uh I cut the cord. I cut the cable cord. Finally, after 30 years, I cut. I'm no longer with uh, cable. They don't hold me hostage. So my sister helped me with that. And then so now I'm. <laughs> that I was her Christmas <laughs> present for you, canceling uh, Carter. <laughs> no. Or Charter. It's Spectrum. Spectrum. It's Spectrum. They've had. They've they've taken advantage of me for the last well, time. Well, you know, to be fair, Gene, that's two hours worth of work. You know, uh, stand, you know, know. waiting hey, online. You and a, then no, no, you have to talk. You have to call them on the phone. You can't cancel online. Have you ever tried to cancel with these guys? Oh, yeah. they're, oh, oh they're I, I can't. I, I have to kick you back up to my supervisor. And yeah. Then it's just oh, someone my God. who's she trying will to not let you go. And then you finally. Like, okay, I'll tell you what I can do. I, oh, my gosh. I'll, I'll cut the that. price in half. Yep. 
Uh, like, no, no, no. I'm trying to cancel. I'm trying to. Cancel. I know, I know. They did all that. Oh, what? Here's what we can do. And I go, I just want internet. I want Wi-Fi. And uh, yeah, here's what we can do. And I was like, no, please, I can't take any more. And and uh, then so you just be like, listen. <laughs> it was pain. My brother's called the right. He goes, it's like breaking up with a girlfriend. And I go, I, it might have been worse. It took longer. And uh. And then I had to go into the office and turn on my cable box to get space. But, but no, why I'm can't cable you just? Free. Well, yeah, why can't you do? I guess do that in the office, but maybe you yeah. can't do that. In and the business, but oh yeah, and also now I, set an appointment. I I went uh, so just Wi-Fi and I I'm YouTube channel. That's what you have, isn't it? You set up a YouTube channel, Jim? No, YouTube TV. Oh, uh, okay. You, you you put YouTube on your TV. I think that's what you. <laughs> that's not. No, I got YouTube TV. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Because they got their own like service now, right? Oh my right? gosh, Package. it's great. They got so ESPN. They got, and you know what the best thing about it? Speaking of sports, they have the Big Ten Network, which I've always wanted. You can pay. I I pay a lot of money for cable in LA. No Big Ten Network. You can't even get, you can't even buy it. So now I have it. So now I, I can watch. Got... Now I can watch Iowa wrestling. <laughs> right. Yeah, we may be. Uh, we may not see too much of Eugene. Oh. I'll be on that channel. I, for I got the alert set for all Iowa sports. Yesterday, I watched Iowa Penn State basketball, and then I can watch Iowa women's volleyball. I'm I'm all in on. Oh, well, the there you go. Yeah, that that's bang for your buck right there. I, I'm surprised I didn't do it earlier, but so I'm finally. So that was a big deal. And then I don't know. We get good guests. It's mostly about the kids, though. Although the kids are starting to grow up. Yeah. 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 We got uh, when they uh, the nephew got when they start daughter. when they start showing up all uh, pimply faced, uh, yeah. not not so cute anymore. Yeah. yeah. Um, all right. Well, yeah, I uh, got to see my nieces and nephews, so they're four and almost two, and then three and a half and two months. So that was uh, that's great. See, nice that's seeing the, the babies. <laughs> and Gene, you uh, you sound like you got very sick. No, Over it was break. just at San Diego. We're doing a lot of yelling, and my boys, my boys is still. It's been it's been ten days. And the I'm game was on shy. like wasn't that game Christmas Day? No, it was uh, a week ago Friday. It was on the twenty seventh. Yeah. Hey, what do you what have you been doing? Cheering ever since? Oh my gosh, yeah. And All that right. horse, that that horse, USC's horse. Aha! We had the last lap this time, traveler. Yeah. <laughs> um. All right. Well, Gene, let's. Uh, we're gonna. It is Sunday night as we record this, and we're gonna start with the big NFL playoff game. Oh my gosh! Minnesota at New Orleans. I will say Orleans. this. I almost. Well, I wa- I saw the second half. Wasn't it ten to nothing at the half? I think it was like thirteen to 13 ten. Thirteen to nothing. No, nah, I think Saints had ten points. I oh. think it was thirteen to ten. I believe. Could oh. be wrong about that. Uh, but uh, basically, Gene, the gist of it is that uh, there was an early turnover. Thielen turned, fumbled oh, early on. I didn't on. see that. I missed the first half. And, but but yeah. New Orleans only scored three points, and the uh, Minnesota defense really held uh, Drew wow. Brees down. That's amazing. For the first half. that All that heartbreak the Saints suffered two years ago against Minnesota, and now they kind of have to go through it again, their own doing. But, uh, yeah. Ooh. Yeah, I thought these, uh, you know, you know, gee, the, the people uh, give shit about uh, Aaron Rodgers and Mike right, McCarthy right. and all that. How about uh, Drew Brees and Sean Payne? Huh? Right, right. They did win one title, so that, that right. That, well, that, yeah, that but no, no, no one's like, oh, Drew Brees needs to win one more Super well, Bowl to get in the could right. get in the Hall of Fame. Hey, that's a great point because huh? they've had they've had monster years, great years, thirteen wins. Uh, f- I don't know, they and had they've had ones. way. And, and Drew Brees has had way better defenses. On the Saints than uh, Rodgers had yeah, for all I'd those years. Yeah, bow out. Boo. I was surprised. And, and the Vikings were, I think, seven-point underdogs. And uh, It's crazy that any of these uh, teams are, like, that big because all these I games know. are going on overtime. Oh, yeah. Part, Same so. thing with uh, uh, New England. They were um, five-point uh, favorites. And Drew Brees looked old. Gene, th- this I is the week I'm, of the old quarterback, Okay, Gene. I wasn't paying a net. Oh, okay. I, yeah, I, he, I, he did not look great, uh, especially in the first half. He was getting sacked, getting well, rattled. He threw an half. interception. And then that's what you get when you watch games without the sound on. You kind of miss <laughs> stuff. <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> but it, you and, know what? Uh, and then the, the Packer game next week, the Packer game, uh, which uh, you, you, I, I'm you will to, turn the sound on. I'm I'm right now. I've not committed to it, but I'm thinking about the Wisconsin Rose Bowl. I almost turned the sound on. So All right. possible. Well, and then uh, this Tyson Tyson Hill. 
Who's this uh, uh, player for the Saints. He's like this quarterback slash receiver slash special oh, okay. teams guy. You've probably seen him, number seven. Yeah. He does all these uh, crazy. They, they were playing him instead of Breeze. Wow. And uh, he was basically unstoppable. He was running for like 13 yards, of, you know, run, a play. He was throwing a bomb the, down the field and all that stuff. But they kept on bringing Drew Brees back in. And, uh, you know, I know uh, Drew Brees' is, uh, you know, uh, records and most yards, most TDs and all this crap. Yeah. But I'm, I'm kind of shocked Sean Payne didn't do a, do a Jim Harbaugh. It was like, uh, or maybe it was John Harbaugh, whatever, the guy from the 49ers. Oh, that was well, Jim. Yeah, it wasn't like, uh, sorry, Drew, uh, you're old as fuck. We need a win, like, right now. Wow. So, uh, yeah, I think uh, I think there's Saints fans are going to be regretting but that. The, the you fact didn't see that, this hey, Bruce, one coming, did you? I game? mean, yeah, I, I, thought, I thought the Saints would probably uh, score, like, 35 <laughs> points, and the Vikings would not score uh, enough points. That, that's kind of how I thought the, uh, the game would uh, be going along. But a uh, couple other points here, Gene. Yes. Stephon Diggs. Uh -huh. did, did you see Stefan? You didn't need the sound on for that. No, I saw Adam oh. Thielen's catch at the end of the game. No, oh, but Stefan Diggs was acting like a crazy maniac oh, uh, wide okay. receiver. Uh, very angry. Do you, do wide receivers like the ball, Gene. Did you, were were yes, you aware of that? They, they're very selfish that way. They always talk about team. Well, not always. Uh, but, yes, they're, they're kind of all about themselves. Going to, going to the sideline, throwing his helmet down. Oh, it's like, really? What? I didn't see that. Yeah, acting like he's a crazy thin, maniac. He's on thin ice anyway, isn't he, for um, just not being a great guy? should be. Well, it is him. Minnesota, Gene. Yeah. Uh, wow, I didn't. Nope, I missed that. Okay, and then I'm did you see my research. Did you see the Delvin uh, Cook touchdown? Was supposedly he crossed the line where he ran it in. Oh, no. I did not cross that. the line. Yeah. There was one replay that clearly showed it. I don't know what the the referees are doing. Okay. And um, yeah, and then uh, yeah, basically goes to overtime. Uh, you know, Saints misplayed the last couple minutes, wow. at least the last couple seconds with the time management. Uh, but they tie the game, goes in overtime. Vikings gets the ball back. It's Man. Kirk Cousins with the ball. Which you would didn't you think uh, advantage Saints? Right, that's what you would think. We well, gotta feel pretty good. Yeah, because he didn't do he didn't do jack for the second half. Right. So um, except for that long pass to Thielen. Well, in, in overtime. Oh no, that was overtime. Yeah, yeah you're so, right. You're right. You're right. Uh, they do uh, get the touchdown, and the Vikings win twenty six to twenty. <coughs> do you think that was offensive? I never even thought about nah, it. I mean, but then I was reading after the game, the offensive not, pass interference on the last play. It, it, the, 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 there's obviously like a threshold. That they have here, yeah. if it's not that, that's not to blame. So, um, but uh, yeah, so Vikings will be going next round to the 49ers in oh, San they go Francisco. Oh, the 49ers. Oh my goodness, that is correct. Wow. So uh, again, Jimmy G and the Viking. I'm sorry, the 49ers defense. Now you would just think 49ers will be huge favorites, but. I'm not, I think they might probably be eight points. Should we do a guess the lines? Jay? I I think. Well, I might be wrong. I think they're ten point. Are they ten point favorites? I'm not sure. Uh, I don't think it should be. Mm, I'm it's gonna, gonna be a lot. It's I'm probably gonna eight. I'm gonna say it's eight. Okay. Um. All right, and then the game that just uh, completed a couple of minutes ago oh was God. the uh, Seahawks versus Eagles. Uh, Carson Wentz gets a gets hit in the back of the head by Clowney's own helmet. Wow! And his head hits the ground, has See, a concussion, is out of the game. I missed that one. I was wa uh, I watched the game. I don't know if it's Josh or Cade McNown, but one of the McNown Gene, uh, whichever McNown it was, not uh, not good. J j oh yes, Josh. Oh, by the way, the the San Francisco seven point favorite. Oh, okay, cool. yeah, uh, Josh. It's Josh. Josh. Uh, Josh McCown. He used to play for the Bears. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but he came in and, uh, you know, what are you going to do? Is your backup. He's a 40 year old backup, you know, reason why he never really. Well, he started for the Jets that year. Right. Didn't he? Mm, could be. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. My Josh McDonald's All right. So knowledge. but basically the uh, Seahawks win and Russell Wilson will be going to Wisconsin to play the Packers. Well, first off, what about that? Sunday what night. about when the uh, Eagles had to stop him on third down and they threw that long pass? Wasn't that something? It was a good call, good throw, yeah, good catch. I mean, that Metcalf that, that's, guy. I, I wish more teams, because most a lot of well, I don't know, a lot of teams would just run the ball, and then make them use another timeout, and then punt, and then hold on. Man, it's, the Seahawks went for it. They went for the win. 
I'll tell and you, they're, they're going to be tough. Don't you think that's going to be a tough game next I hope week? It should be a tough game. Correct. But I think the Packers' defense is going to shut down Russell Wilson. All right. There and you go. And I think it's going to be 17-10 Packers. That's my oh, prediction. Oh, I hope so. Is that uh, – mm, I don't even know. What time is that game? It's uh, at three. It's at three forty. Oh. Uh, P.M. on the West Coast on oh, Sunday. Oh, so that's a late game. I hope it snows. Yep. That would be great, wouldn't it? <laughs> yeah, sure. Why not? Playing a snowstorm. Oh, let's go pack. Okay, I'm so, all in. Uh, yep. All right. So very exciting time. Two uh, two NFC North teams still in the playoffs. I guess two NF uh, NFC West teams too. I guess that's pretty oh, exciting, that right? New Orleans, they got to be sick. Another wasted. I think it could be another wasted year. And then, uh, yeah, this could be end of the Drew. Isn't his contract? I don't know if his contract's up. Well, I think we'll it's. A, I think it's two more years left. Oh, okay, uh, I could be completely yeah. wrong right. about that. All right, so just a couple odds and ends, uh, really quick, Gene. Yeah. Uh, the NFL has unveiled the top ten quarterbacks named to the league's all-time team. Oh, this is BS. And two right? of the all-time greats have been left out. Aaron Rodgers and Drew Brees didn't earn a spot on the roster. <coughs> the top ten quarterbacks are an Ethel Baker, Sammy Bog. I know. And did you? I heard about this this Sammy week. Sammy Bog. Can he you? He threw more interceptions and touchdowns, didn't he? Do you have that? No, I don't have it. Oh. Tom Brady. Yeah. Okay. okay sure. Whatever. John Elway. All yeah. right, sure. Okay, Brett whatever. Favre. Yeah. Does he have more interceptions uh, than Sammy Bog? I don't know. I Sammy Bog threw a lot of – I think he threw more interceptions. Otto than Graham? Than yeah. I, well, I, was talking, I don't know. Payne Manning? Right. Yeah, that's good. Dan yeah. Marino, Joe Montana, Roger Staubach. Uh, that's J- Johnny Unitas. That – Oh, you can't leave Aaron Rodgers and Drew. I don't think. I mean, I don't know why everyone. This isn't, you know, this isn't baseball. Okay. Right. I mean, the game has evolved, obviously, right? So the importance of the quarterback has increased probably over the last thirty years more than any other position player on football. So doesn't it make sense that the best players are the quarterbacks and the best players yeah. have that have played the game? Yeah. Um, you know. Yeah, put Aaron Rodgers in. Well, I don't know. Maybe Dan Marino. Yeah, put Aaron Rodgers in. Hey, listen. No one is Googling Otto Graham highlights <laughs> on YouTube. That's for sure. And if they are, he's like, he's like, he's like, he's like shot putting the ball. <laughs> I know. All it's right? just a different. It's hard to. I guess you got to credit some of those old timers, you know. But I don't. Uh, that's a tough. And one. he was playing against the Pittsburgh Steagles, okay, <laughs> or the Pennsylvania Steagles, right? Yeah. This is, I mean, uh, the what was Green Bay? Oh, they they used to be um, the Acme Packers. Yeah, right? the Acme Packers. Right. Yeah, this wasn't. I mean, this was not a billion dollar, uh, you know, league where there's so much money at stake, you know, to be the best. You know. Mm. All right, and wow, this is gonna be exciting, then. So what a double right. header. Are Couple they both on? No. No, one's going to be on uh, – oh, well, yeah. there's four games. So yeah, there's four games. There's so two, two, two more days of football. Yeah. All right, so a couple other uh, notes, Gene. We are excited to announce the NFL League office has assigned the Cincinnati Bengals what? and the Detroit Lions as the coaching staffs for the um, uh, the futures, you know, the high school. Oh, my God. The, the, the Seniors Bowl. The Seniors Bowl announced that the coaching staff of the Bengals and the Detroit Lions. Yeah. Will be coaching that game where the uh, seniors of the high school players play. Gene, uh, isn't this isn't this child abuse, Gene? Does this, this constitute child abuse? Oh my gosh! Would would you want uh, Gene? If you're eighteen, a uh, seventeen year old uh, wide receiver, would you want to be coached by Matt Patricia? No, I would not. I actually watched some of the senior. They had a senior all star game yesterday, and they had those those stupid kids. With all the hats in front of them, and then they pick one out. And go, just pick one already, dude. What the hell? I mean, yeah. you're not. You're all that right now. Wait till you get on campus, and you, yeah. you're surrounded by fellow all Americans. This, this, listen, this is this ain't three card Monty. <laughs> I, all right, I know. I know. And you guys try to fake you out. How, oh how, my God. how about if you picked it up and there was a uh, Mercedes Benz key underneath the uh, yeah. key fob underneath yeah. the hat? Huh? So. Right, right. How about that? 
All right, and then Gene, you know right. the uh, I guess one of the benefits of oh. uh, getting stuck with your family, yes. um, during the uh, holidays is uh, right. you're you're basically forced to watch college football. We well, uh, luckily my family all loves it except for my older sister, but she wasn't she didn't go to the Holiday Bowl. But yeah, so we watch this game all together. Gene, a couple of thoughts about college football. Yeah, it's great, is that, isn't uh, it? I mean, there's no defense, Gene. Oh, it, people well. are running oh, fifty well, yards. Well, that's okay. you, you make a completion, you run fifty yards, you score right. a ball, score a touchdown. Did you watch a lot of the bowl games? So, I watched so much college. It was great. Watched some of that LSU. It was a blowout, though, that right? Was it was bad. like seven touchdowns in the yeah, uh, first half. Seven. That's not good. And then we did watch. Uh, I did watch uh, most of uh, Ohio. The Ohio State uh, versus Clemson. Hmm. And, uh, Gene, maybe you can help me out here, Gene. Uh, yeah. How is yeah. it that Ohio State has a couple players wearing the same number? I noticed that they have some. There's guys. like there's like an I offensive know. guy and a defensive yeah, guy, each four. wearing number one and two. Right, right, right. And I'm like asking my uncles, like, what's going on with this? Everyone thinks I'm like have too much uh, <laughs> Christmas punch. <laughs> no, they do that. Uh, well, there's uh, so many players, I uh, guess. Have to if they're gonna up. kick number one out of the game, how do you know which one it is? Right, I mean, right. it's. Yeah, I noticed that. Are, I, are there student records the same thing? The same yeah. people? Maybe that's what it is. One guy's. <laughs> going to basket weaving the other one's going to uh the nutrition class yeah if you're i i'm with you if you're good enough to start on both sides just give them their own number okay i mean is ohio state retired every goddamn number that they gotta do some repeats now <laughs> oh my god can so has anyone no one is discussing this I don't know. I I, I, know, I noticed it. I don't though. think the commentators uh mentioned this it's kind, of, kind of something you might want to you know discuss like what's going on Probably the weirdest thing about the game. You're right. I I'm with you on that one. I thought that was very odd. All Although right. I knew they did that, but. And uh, thank God that uh, Clemson got it done. Wait. Jeez. Where's your <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> where's your love for Ohio State? I hate I I hate the Ohio State. It's so. To be. I'm sorry. You're making me laugh. You're supposed to be all in on the Big Ten. No, Gene, I'm not the one that shelled out for YouTube TV. All right, I don't need any uh, oh. any reason to watch. Uh, but yeah, so Clemson is going to play LSU, I guess, on the 13th. Why, why do these kids get two weeks off, Gene? This what? is this is ridiculous. Let's get it over with already. Uh, they're going to be graduated before the game. They should be game. playing tomorrow night. They, they should be playing. I know. I mean, th not that the interest is even that high right now anyway, and then you're going to wait two more weeks? What else are they doing? I don't know. All right, and then the other uh, big bowl game that uh, pertains to this uh, show oh, is uh, not, wait, Wisconsin. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> is uh, Wisconsin <laughs> losing to the, the the Ducks, the Oregon Ducks in the Gosh, Rose Bowl? I, I like Oregon a lot. But man, the Badgers! I thought they had them. I watched the first half uh, in the uh, airport because right. I was flying back on uh, oh, New okay. Year's Day. I think the Badgers kind of blew it. They and then, I, well, yeah. apparently there was like a penalty. There was yeah. like a pass interference or something like that that went against Wisconsin. Yeah, I missed that. Play. And Oregon won uh, by one point. So that's what I'm saying. Like all these, you know, these, these college sports just don't. These are just kids. They're not. They're going to disappoint you. They're just going to. Don't get – Hey, we J. can't J. compete. J.J. Watt – I saw J.J. Watt and Russell Wilson play for the Badgers in the Rose Bowl. So. Yeah. Well. And they lost – gosh, can you imagine? They had those two guys on the team, and they lost to Texas Tech star – no, Texas – no, they lost to Texas TCU with Andy Dalton. Yep. Yeah. Uh, well, that's what I'm saying, Gene. Wisconsin plays it fair. All oh, right, I they're see. not they're not going out and buying the uh, the biggest free agent in high school, you know, like all these other. Gene Oregon, yeah, Spon sponsored by Phil Knight, Nike. That's right. All that money, yeah. it's going somewhere. It's you, going you, in you, someone's pocket. Gene, you know who sponsors the Badgers? Oh, who? <laughs> Bur Burlington Coat Factory. <laughs> that's what. <laughs> How are we supposed to compete? How are we supposed to compete with Nike, Gene? Oh my gosh! You know, um, <laughs> it's now. Yeah, they can't. That's why they had to drop Coke Factory. Now it's just Burlington. Burlington. Have you noticed that, Gene? We, we got Coles, Gene. That's what sh sh we had Shopko. Oh yeah, Shopko's right. out of business. Yeah, 
That's right. Call the shop company. <laughs> yeah. All right. That's what I'm saying. Don't. That's why I can't. Because the Badgers are always going to lose to the uh, the big the big teams. Yeah. All right. Well, Gene, we're gonna before you die of asphyxiation. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, I, I, I hate Badgers. Good job. Oh, the, Barry Alvarez was at the game too. So yeah, uh, there's he's a, looking a little old. But there, there's you know. uh, there's a sh- well, yeah. And then his weren't they saying his grandson was playing? Oh, could have. I been. think I heard yeah, that. I could I be wrong. No, I didn't have, oh, but I wonder way, how he got in. Yeah, I wonder how he got on the team, Gene. Uh huh. I see. Badgers baffling got a great program. But listen, to this uh, Iowa Hawkeyes they took off their their Iowa Tiger Hawk off their helmet in honor of Hayden Fry legendary coach who died right before the holiday ball so and they want it for him good job hawkeyes okay i bet you asked any of those guys two days beforehand who who is this man they, yeah. they would have no idea well no idea. yeah uh, all right well gene we got a uh we're gonna Ooh. end it with uh, a couple of uh negative stories oh it can't be iowa uh, i was already uh, well there's turn. one iowa story and just oh, for good no. measure gene there's one uh wisconsin story okay so uh, we're both going to get it this week. Mm. Um, we'll start with Wisconsin. Uh, a Wisconsin English teacher has admitted to defecating on oh. a building in public park for more than two years, a report oh, said. Oh, I heard about this, but I didn't know it was a guy from Wisconsin. Jeffrey Churchwell, 60, who will be retiring from Milton School District in January. Oh, my God. Allegedly fussed to littering in Natural Land Park with poop. Since 2017, leaving behind his human waste and used toilet paper. Wow. According to the Janesville Gazette. So it must be in the Janesville yeah. area. So that's that's pretty embarrassing. That's Jane. a rough one. I heard this story and I was like, oh my gosh, I didn't know it was Wisconsin. That's a bad story. That's a rough one. No good. Yeah. Yeah, not something you want to read on your uh, morning news term. All right, and then this is uh, this is not really a bad story, but uh, this is related to uh, Iowa, Gene. Oh, okay. Um, Gene, uh, L- the movie Lolita, Stanley Kubrick's Lolita. Yes, Are you I saw it. That oh, movie? yeah, that that's back from the '60s or late '50s. I believe uh, James Mason. He plays yep. the uh, older the, dude, the, the pedophile. Yes. Yeah. Um, so do you know the uh, name of the uh, lady who played Lolita? Uh, I'm going to say, what's her name? Oh, I know. <coughs> Natalie Wood. <laughs> Is that right? No, nah, no. Nah, it's Sue Lyon or Leon or Lyon. I thought that was a good guess. It's not. Uh, yeah, you're probably right. Uh, she was in like two more things. So okay. uh, you're forgiven for, for not being famous. Yeah. Um, however, were you aware that she was uh, from Davenport, Iowa? Oh, no, I did not know that. Right, <clears throat> right down the Mississippi River. Yep. So, another uh, story of a good Iowa getting Gene. out of. Uh, and uh, how and about this? Bernie Sanders was in Dubuque. So was Joe Biden this week. Both of them were in Dubuque, my who, hometown. Who is week. your mom going to vote for? Uh, well, I think. She, no, she likes she likes Mayor Pete, the guy that uh, came out as uh, gay. The, uh, is that his name? <laughs> well, any any other uh, platforms <laughs> I, that you know? I, any, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know much about him. Uh, I, He's uh, the gay candidate. Yeah, but uh, that's who my mom seems fixated on right now. She doesn't love Joe I Biden. Think, um, I liked Warren at the beginning, but then um, I don't like her. Anymore. I think um, yeah, I think Biden is going to be the. Uh, have you seen those uh, ads for mm-hmm. Biden? I don't. Yeah, they're pretty. They're pretty. Uh, they're pretty good. Okay. Pretty good. Well, then maybe I'll reconsider. Um. All right. Well, Gene. Yes. It's a. Uh, it's a new year. It's 2020. Fantastic. Great start. Oh yeah, it wasn't a great start because the Badgers lost. It's gonna be a great start next week. Gosh, the Seahawks are gonna be tough. Clowney's good, isn't he? Well, yeah. When when he's not when he's spearing your quarterback in the back of the head with oh, his yeah, helmet. I forgot about that. How about he oh. get thrown out? Huh? How about that? That's, that's not going to fly. Let's not do that, Terrence. And Lambo. By the way, right. we are uh, it's sleeping Lambo right now oh my where gosh, there fantastic. is uh, snow. Hey, let's get a big snowstorm and then get the locals to shovel out the snow and then the Packers go in there and beat the crap out of Seahawks. By the way, driving in snow, Gene, not, uh, 
Oh my gosh, that's tricky. Not not a fan of that. Not oh, a fan. Oh, it's de- it's so de- it's just su- yeah. I haven't done it for a while, but no. And oh, I yeah, it's dangerous. Because you can drive, you're driving all right, and then you gotta make a turn. All of a sudden, oh, <laughs> you're sliding around. There you go. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, Gene, uh, yeah. happy New Year. Oh, same deal. And all my family, thank you for being my family. Everyone's family. Uh huh. Okay. Mm yeah, you too. Right. Happy New Year to you, buddy. Well, I appreciate that. All right, so we can get the uh, music going here, right? Um, so for why is, why is this going? Oh, we could sing it. I don't know the words, so I, I'm not sure of the words. Or the All right, words. so well for Gene Steichen, mm-hmm. my name is. Oh, there we go. My name. Oh. All right, so for Gene Steichen, my name is Chris Stock, and it's. 